This is code.org. Let's see what we got. Edit the spinning right behavior. The this sprite block should be used instead of the costume block. This will make it work for any sprite, regardless of the costume it uses. Debug. Make all the stars spin the same way. Okay, let's see. Oh, this guy's left out. All right, so what's happening? It says to edit the spinning right block. So let's take a look. And notice, by the way, look, it's used here. Where else is it used? Right here. Here. Okay. So we're using it twice. Let's see. Spinning right. And then edit. And this, spinning right with this sprite. Turn. Oh, and that's these. So it only turns that sprite. Make it all spin. Hmm. Well, this is tricky because we have four of the same sprite here, and then we have one of this sprite. However, I'm here, I'm asking this sprite to spin right. How many of these? Well, I'm asking all four of them, right? It's not a specific sprite because all of them are this sprite. So all of these are going to spin right. Up here, then, I ask this sprite to spin right. Well, wait a minute. I already did that. I already asked all of these to spin right. I'm doing this twice, okay? I'm asking twice for, I'm saying this sprite begins spinning the other sprite right. So it says it's in this sprite, but what it starts to do is spin the other sprites. So actually the other sprites are just getting spun twice as fast, okay? We're leaving it out. So instead of saying this sprite spins the other sprites, what if we use this block here? going to grab that and get rid of it. Then this sprite, close, this sprite here begins spinning right. And what's it spinning? The sprite, right? So that sprite's going to spin. We could also do that down here because this is the sprite that's going to get to spin. And this sprite is going to be spinning right. Notice that it auto changed, right? Because these are the same thing, but it's going to work for both. Because on both, we told it which one. This star is going to go right, and all of these stars are going to go right. So we could use this same spinning right function, spinning right code, for each. Because right before it runs, we tell it which sprite we mean. Let's check it out. This stuff is getting complicated, but it's going to be super useful. We're going to be able to make games with this. Let's keep going.